Hello, mathematicians. Today we're going to be learning about systems of equations. And more specifically, we're going to be graphing in slope-intercept form to see how many solutions two lines have. So here we have y is equal to negative 2x minus 1, and we have y is equal to x plus 2. So we're going to graph these two and see how many times they intersect. So for our first equation, y is equal to negative 2x minus 1, we know that our slope is negative 2. If it makes it easier, we could put that over 1, so we know our rise and our run. And then here we have our y-intercept, which is negative 1. And so I'm going to start off by plotting our y-intercept. Since it's negative 1, that means it crosses our y-axis at negative 1. And from this point, we could now um, we can now plot our next point using our slope. So since the slope is negative 2 over 1, we could go down 2. So 1, 2 over 1, down 2 over 1, down 2 over 1. Okay, so now we have four points here. That's more than enough points so that we could draw our line. And I could just extend that. So here I have our line for our first equation, y is equal to negative 2x minus 1. So let's plot y is equal to x plus 2. So for our next equation here, even though there is no coefficient in front of x, we know that it is 1. So if there's no coefficient and it's just x, it is 1, and you could write it out, or you could just leave it blank. And here our y-intercept is positive 2, so I could start off by plotting our y-intercept. And since our slope is 1, we know that it's going to be 1 over 1, so it rises 1, goes over 1. Same thing, up 1 over 1, up 1 over to the right 1. And so I have my four points here, and again, that's more than enough. So now I could draw my line through these. And once we do that, we could see that our lines have one solution. And it's one solution because the lines cross at exactly one point. And this point is negative 1, 1. So after we plot these two lines, our solution is one solution. And it crosses at negative 1, 1. So our answer would be negative 1, 1. And that's it. So here we have another example. And we have y equals negative 2 over 3x minus 1. So we're going to do the same thing. And we're going to plot the y-intercept first, which is negative 1. And our slope is negative 2 over 3. So our rise is negative 2, meaning we go down 2 units. And then our run is 3, positive 3, so we go to the right 3. And we could do the same thing again, so we're going to go down 2 over 3. Down 2 to the right 3, because the 3 is positive, and we go down because the 2 is negative. So once we have a few points here, we could draw our line through it. Okay, and now we have x is equal to 3, and whenever we see our equation like this, we know that it's a vertical line. So at x equals 3, since our x value is always equal to 3, it's any point that lies on this vertical line. Okay. So our solution here is where these two lines intersect, and they intersect right here at 3, negative 3. So our solution here is one solution, and it's 3, negative 3. So here we have another example, y equals negative x plus 3. So we could start off by plotting 
this equation. So we know that the y-intercept is positive 3. So that's where it crosses the y-axis. And we know that our slope is negative 1 over 1. So our rise is negative 1, meaning we go down 1. And our run is positive 1, meaning we go to the right 1. So we go down 1 to the right 1, down 1 to the right 1. And once we have a few points, we could go ahead and draw our line. And so now we have y is equal to 5 over 2x minus 4. We could start off by plotting our y-intercept, which is a negative 4 over here. And we know that our slope is positive, so we're going to go up 5. So our rise is positive 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And we're going to go to the right 2. We're going to go up again 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then we're going to go to the right 2. So now I'm going to draw our line. And we could see that these two lines meet at 2, 1, making this our solution. So it's one solution at 2, 1. All right, here we have our last example. y is equal to 4x minus 4. So we know that our y-intercept is negative 4. And we know that our slope is positive 4 over 1, meaning our rise is 4. We're going to go up 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. And then our run is 1. So since it's positive, we're going to go to the right. So 1, 2, 3, 4 to the right 1. 1, 2, 3, 4 to the right 1. And now we're going to plot our line. And then we're going to do the same thing for our second equation. So our second equation is x, y is equal to x plus 2. Our y-intercept is 2. And our slope is 1 over 1. So we're going to go up 1 to the right one, up one to the right one, up one to the right one, and so on. So let's draw our line. So here we see that our two lines meet once, so it's one solution, and they meet at 2, 4. So it's one solution, and our one solution is 2, 4. And that's it.